Today I want to talk about a really cool tool I found uh, searching the internet uh, for helping you with your students essays. I will include the URL below the YouTube video because it's pretty much impossible to remember this URL that's quite lengthy. So it's a tool that I used to have in my class was an essay map and I used to use a bunch of handouts and until recently still use handouts. Uh, until I saw this tool. This tool will do it for you as well. One important caution, you can save the essay map, but it is a local file. So that means you need to uh, make sure it's saved somewhere safe and that you can access it later. And if uh, you want it uh, in the cloud, you'll have to upload it to an account like a Google Drive or a Dropbox so that you can access it from anywhere. So that's just a caution. So essay map, I'm gonna click on get started and it will open a window and it will give you the option to uh, open if you've already worked on the file. So this is what you would do if you have the file already saved. So I'll give myself a name or a name and I'll give it a topic. I'll say history. All right, I'll click get started. So write one or two sentences that introduces your topic, including a brief description. So this is where you would work with your students, teach them how to write the introduction intro is blah 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 i'm not going to really write anything i'm pretty sure most of us are comfortable with essay writing see right beneath you got your three main arguments so if you were doing a two paragraph essay you would just tell the students listen just fill in these first two same thing here idea one what is it what are you trying to prove okay and then um, just go on and add that uh, probably would have put what you're trying to prove in the main intro or what is your hypothesis and for each one we'll click underneath one three supporting ideas so blah 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 one blah, blah. so this is a great way for students to create their basic skeleton of their essay before they write it and at the end of course you just click this arrow conclusion and you see that's great because the arrows point here and often students for some reason have a hard time remembering to bring in information from the different paragraphs. Very visual tool, excellent. And here's how you save it. So save, and I'll give it a, a, a name. I'll write history sample. And remember, this is not cloud-based. So a little local file, and you will have to uh, make sure your students uh, upload it to uh, your Google Drive if you're using Chromebooks, or if you're using um, laptops or something else, they should uh, save it locally. So we'll click save, and there it is, RWT file, save, and we're good. So the next time, I just need to click open and upload the file, find my file, and I know where I put it, and that's it. So essay map, a great tool, very easy. Uh, I will leave the URL below the YouTube video. Thanks a lot.